Okay, a uh, scientist studying some rabbits, a disease is killing the rabbits. Uh, population from 240 reduced to 180 in two days. So, uh, Kai Siang, this is the keyword. Uh. Two days. The rabbit population is reduced exponentially. Okay, this is another keyword. Uh, let me highlight for you. They use the word exponentially. So, uh, we have to use some exponential equation. Lah. Uh, how many rabbits will still be around at the end of seven days so after seven days how many rabbits will still be around so first of all we use a diagram to represent this so 240 days uh, after two days uh, it turned out to be 180 so the first day we do not know so for the x here the second day it becomes 180 correct okay so this is the first day this is the second day okay so it's pretty easy it is very straightforward so 240 then basically after the first day and the second day is 180 so and they use the word exponential you can see the word here exponential so if they use the word exponential the formula the general formula for exponential would be y equals to a x to the power of uh, t or sometimes we use the word a x to the power of n uh, same thing the n of a t represents what we call this as um uh, exponential okay so on the second day let's look at the second day first uh, 180 so what we're going to do is we're going to apply this 180 uh, this a is the starting point uh, this is start Okay, which is 240 uh, the rate x is the rate of exponential that we do not have this is the rate of exponential okay then this t uh, represent the number of days <coughs> the number of days so in this case we have two days so first thing you should do is take 180 divided by 240 equals to uh, x to the power of 2 so here you're gonna get uh, 18 over 24 cancel cancel um let's divide this by 6 you're gonna get 3 on top 6 you're gonna get 4 here correct so in actual fact x squared equals to 3 over 4 okay so how much is x x equals to 3 over 4 square root and the rate the rate of exponential uh, you need to use a calculator to find this huh? so based on the calculator let me get my scientific calculator first so you're gonna get um, first um, 3 to the power a uh, 3 not to the power sorry 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 3 over 4 to the power of uh, square root 2 okay this square root 2 so when you square root 2 you're going to get 0 0.8660 0. okay so that is what we call it as a rate of rate of what they call this um, the exponential uh. So, even you see the rate is less than 1, uh, here you can see the rate is 0 0.866. If it's less than 1, means it's decreasing. Uh, that means it's correct. You're doing the right thing. Okay. Uh, we can double check again. Basically, just double check the whole thing again so that we want to make sure that um, 3 divided by 4. Yeah, 0 0.866. Okay. So, once we get that right, after 7 days, so what we're going to do is uh, 240 days. Um, to the rate is at 0 0.8660 so we already have the equation actually uh, y equals to uh, i'm going to use black, black color lah. blue is not so good uh, y equals to a x to the power of t so at seven days we start out with 240 the rate is 0 0.8660 and to the power of seven days lah. Uh, 
after seven days. So again, the calculator two hundred forty multiply by put a bracket here. Oh, Zero point eight six six zero to the power of seven. So you're gonna left with eighty seven point six six seven. Um, yeah, sixty seven. But you know, right? Uh, rabbits cannot be less than one. I mean, like between it's a decimal number. So, I think the best answer you can give is eighty seven, lah. Like, I wouldn't say eighty eight or so because um, it doesn't make sense to get anything like zero point like zero point five human or zero point five coconut uh, coconut still possible like you can chop it off right zero point five rabbits is like a zero point six rabbits is impossible so it's gonna stick to eighty seven lah okay uh you can just try out the answer and see it's either eighty seven or eighty eight that, that that would be the best answer all right that's it bye see ya